Now we are going to see a new chapter perimeter and area. First we must know about what is perimeter. Perimeter is the distance around the edge of the figure. Perimeter is the distance around the edge of the figure. Uh, consider any kind of a figure because any kind of figure means any kind of a shape. What are the shapes you know that already you have studied in the early classes. That means uh, for example circle, square, rectangle and uh, what is this uh, triangle, uh, diamond and all these things even cylinder these are all the shapes otherwise we can call this figures okay so in this particular uh, particular topic we can call it as a figure so perimeter is the distance around the edge of a figure so consider this is in a rectangle this is a rectangle so now we are going to see perimeter of rectangle after that we will see perimeter of a square now we are going to see perimeter of a rectangle see first we must know what is rectangle rectangles is a what is a shape okay it has four sides or many sides it has four sides and it has two lengths and two breadths so two lengths are equals so two lengths are equal two breadths are equal always so it has four sides and two lengths and two breadths are equal this is a major property of rectangle and one more thing I just want to tell you what are the examples of uh, rectangle rectangle means we consider a door so door is a what it's a rectangle shape and after that is a blackboard this is the black this is a whiteboard we can imagine this is a blackboard it is also a rectangle shape because this is length and this corner is a what you called as a breadth okay this is breadth and this is length and after that paper you can take any kind of a paper it is also a what a rectangle it is a rectangle in shape and tv look at this tv it is a rectangle shape so this is length and this is what breadth length and this is breadth and after the table any kind of a table it is also a rectangle shape so these are the examples of rectangle and i've told you the properties already told you the properties it has four sides it has four sides it has two lengths and two breadths and two lengths and two breadths are equal this is the thing so perimeter i've told you perimeter is a distance around the edge of the figure that means this is the shape of the rectangle so perimeter means around the distance what is called is around the distance around means outer side of the outer side of the shape outer side of the rectangle that is called as perimeter so look at this this is length and this is breadth so just imagine this is a blackboard the blackboard length is 55 centimeter and the breadth is 40 centimeter so i've told you this is the long uh, very longest side longest side is always called as length and this is a little uh, compared to length breadth is always what less lesser side so breadth b means breadth it is 40 centimeter length l means length it is 55 centimeter now we are going to calculate the perimeter of rectangle first we must know what is the formula of perimeter of rectangle so 2 into l plus b 2 into l plus b this is the formula i have written on the board formula of the perimeter of rectangle is equal to 2 into l plus b i have told you this is l and this is also what l this is length and this is it. two lengths are equal so the value of length is equal to 55 centimeter so uh, l is equal to 55 centimeter and again l is equal to 50, 55 centimeter even you consider as a small thing means l is equal to 10 centimeter you can take any kind of a shape another rectangle another paper whatever it may be 5 centimeter means length is 10, 5 centimeter means again length is 5 centimeter breadth is 4 centimeter means again breadth is 4 centimeter so two lengths and two breadths are equal always so here 55 centimeter you have 55 centimeter length and breadth 40 centimeter and 40 centimeter so two lengths and two breadths are equal so it has four sides it's the properties of the rectangle so don't forget the properties of rectangle now we are going to solve the problem let's start the problem two is a formula i've told you first you have to write length of the length of the blackboard length of the blackboard that means you can get what 55 centimeter and breadth b r e a b r e a d h breadth b r e a d t h breadth of the blackboard that means what is this 40 centimeter the formula now you have to perimeter therefore perimeter perimeter of the perimeter of a rectangle 
is equal to in this place rectangle but you should write perimeter of a blackboard okay because but you have to perimeter of a blackboard but you have to apply what so you have to apply the formula of perimeter of rectangle because blackboard is what shape rectangle shape so even whiteboard is also rectangle in shape so formula is 2 into l plus b this is the formula you have to apply so 2 l means 55 plus and uh, within the bracket 2 within the bracket 55 is the length and uh, breadth is 40 so 2 you have to add first within the bracket you have to take 55 plus 40 this is called as 95 add 95 you just write within the bracket 95 after that you have to multiply both numbers 2 into 95 you have to multiply so 95 into 2 5 to certain carry 1 9 to 18 18 plus 1 190 the answer is 190 what centimeter only you must use you should not write centimeter squared because centimeter is, is the right answer because area of the, sorry perimeter perimeter of the blackboard perimeter of a blackboard or perimeter of a rectangle means you have to use only what units only that means centimeter means centimeter meter means meter you have to write okay so 190 centimeter this is the right answer for the question so the entire perimeter of the blackboard is what 190 centimeter that's all